Hi. Morning. Mo- ah, not morning. Afternoon. Afternoon. Yes. Hi yeah. guys. Welcome back to this YouTube channel. Mm-hmm. My name is Diana Kemi and this is my sister Baby, Baby Karo. So welcome back and I'm really happy once again to be in the village. Wow. <laughs> yeah. How was the city life? You know we had hey. missed you so much. The city life yeah. is nice. Mm-hmm. And um, okay, not really much, much nice. Mm-hmm. I don't know why, but I really prefer <laughs> village. <laughs> village. Yeah, because village, a kind of mm-hmm. school with mm-hmm. the fresh air. Mm-hmm. And uh, just for that short time, I'd missed this nice fresh air from the village. Wow. And uh, yeah, and also I'd missed you. <laughs> oh, I missed you too. I was wondering, when, yeah. when, when will you come back? Yeah. Yeah, because but, I was also lonely and... I'm so happy you arrived safely. Thank you. And welcome to African Serenity Garden. Wow, thank you so much. Yeah. And I'm also happy. Mm-hmm. And uh, yeah, it, it was nice. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can see the maize has... They have grown. They have grown. They yeah. started bringing out this. Yeah. This Even things. leave this one. The downer one. Yeah. They have grown big than this one. Wow. Yeah. So I think even the downer part is more fertile more than this one. Maybe yeah. the harvesting season will be... <laughs> we'll start with those ones. <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah. It will start soon. Yeah. From the look of things, I'm seeing the maize but right are coming up. To go inside, disappear. Not like before. Yeah. Wow. See this one. Where? This big, big, big maize here. Wow. It's almost ready to be harvested. Oh my God. Guys, yeah. see, already we have maize here. Yeah. And wow. Some have put twins. Mm-hmm. You see? <laughs> yeah, this one is for it twins. It put double. One, yeah. two. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think there is going to be nice harvest here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. Even so our neighbor has some maize. On the other side? Yeah. But this one I haven't really done well mm-hmm. so much when you look at them. Yeah. I think it's because of the fertilizer. fertilizer. Yeah. Yeah, they didn't put because I can see also mm-hmm. it has started uh, putting maize when it's still young. when it's still small so yeah. you know it should have been much uh, bigger like this one yeah yeah but it's it's much young yeah. so that means they didn't put uh, fertilizer if they could put mm-hmm. it would uh, be like this yeah. so there's some difference when I look at it mm-hmm. oh guys it's not like I'm comparing <laughs> <laughs> no but it's yeah. the truth um, yeah. see, even when you walk like to most farms yeah. uh, some people don't put fertilizer and some do mm-hmm. so when you see this maize you'll just know this one hasn't been put fertilizer this one has because the one which has it usually is so green and you just see it like it's so healthy mm-hmm. yeah wow so i think mm-hmm. uh, um you know mm-hmm. yeah it's a blessing so we're going to harvest a nice maize here yeah. we had put this f- just for a start mm-hmm. we thought mm, maybe instead of just leaving the land bare like that mm-hmm. uh, why don't we just put maize meanwhile because mm-hmm. we haven't gone to landscaping yeah. Uh, so much mm-hmm. and everything because mm-hmm. um, the someone was still advising me on how I'm going to make this compound mm-hmm. so with the time mm-hmm. yeah we're going to there but uh, meanwhile as we still work inside the house because mm-hmm. uh, we are going to do uh, the other session of wearing mm-hmm. we are going to still mm-hmm. make use of uh, this a little portion of land on this yeah. other side it's yeah. not really that small because mm-hmm. you know the maize have really grown For i me, can't even, even I see the road to harvest them they look nice no you know yeah. why yeah it has some privacy you know when <laughs> they were not there someone can see you on the road yeah yeah but right now uh at least uh no one can see you like they've grown so big until it's like a fence <laughs> So, <laughs> for me, I don't want them to be, yeah, we'll harvest them, but I don't want them to be cut, but it will just uh, force us to cut it because they will be dry. Yeah, we'll need to plant uh, more, more, more maize mm-hmm. later. Mm-hmm. Y- yeah, and I think we really need a fence actually, guys. Yeah. So, so much. Look, guys, mm-hmm. there's this temporary one, mm-hmm. but uh, for just, you know, nice security we need one cause uh, there's a story which one time guys when I, um, when i'll have that good time i'll share with you yeah, yeah i just feel i need a fence yeah. around my house cause a uh, lot of things have been happening which you know you we actually don't say everything on media yeah but 
soon we'll start working on the fencing. Yeah. Yeah, just it's a matter of time. Yeah. Yeah, just to ensure the compound is well secure cause there's yeah. still some theft. Yeah. Yeah. There's still some theft cases anyway. Yeah. Yeah. So this is it guys. We are in the village, back in the village and missed this. Back in the village where there's a lot of greens. You know in the greens. city, yes, see buildings. Car. Very true, very true. Mm -hmm. I really missed this because um, it's just a short time. Maybe mm -hmm. I think we only spent three days. Three days. Maybe three or four, but it, it oh. looked a lot. It looked like even one week. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it was nice. Mm -hmm. um, it was nice to change the environment just for, you know, some time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I think it should be like that. Mm -hmm. You know, not every time you should spend your whole life in the, in the village. village. Yeah. yeah. You, you get Sometimes your mind. you visit once, you explore. You come so back. You yeah. come back. Because uh, I realized when you're in the city, mm -hmm. your minds op open up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't get so rigid. Yeah. 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 You, you, you get what I'm saying? <laughs> I mean, the what English I mean, has disappeared. Okay, okay. What yeah, I mean is, yeah. at least you have exposure yeah. to oh, things. Oh, yeah, yeah. Now yeah, understood you. Yeah. 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 That exposure really helps. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, even the places where you work, you can also, like for example, us here, the way we are doing some construction, mm -hmm. we can also get ideas yeah. on new modern things mm -hmm. yeah like we don't put the analog way the because things because actually most of the houses they are they are all modern modern yeah. or even if it's ancient one mm -hmm. they have tried to renovate and you know modernize it mm -hmm. yeah so wow. that is it wow. so from here guys that is mm -hmm. the farm progress and mm -hmm. the farm is doing very very well before we used to plate these things when you were kids yeah i remember yeah yeah. So uh, and, and also, also eating the the, the stock can. for the <laughs> maize. Yeah, but right now we can't do that. No. Yeah. Yeah, but it was usually sweet that time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Because actually, not most people planted the sugar cane. So maize they were grown in plenty. Mm -hmm. So you could just uh, go to the farm, take one piece, and you just pluck it like a sugar cane. Yeah. Yeah. But right now. Mm -mm. That's nice. We are grown up. <laughs> we can't yeah. go back there. Yeah. Yeah. That one we've left for our younger siblings. Yeah. Yeah. So, guys, that is life in the village. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, my sister was remaining here, mm -hmm. and there was one to three things she tried to do, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I saw you cleaning around the the windows. Oh yeah. Yeah. Right now you can see yourself through. Oh. <laughs> Wow, it's clean. Oh. <laughs> it's clean. See yourself. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for this nice work. Welcome. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So that means even if I'm uh, far away, mm -hmm. my sister can still manage the house. Yeah. Even if you go to, let's say you travel in another country and yeah. like you don't have to worry, maybe things will be in a mess mm -hmm. or anything. No. Things will be fine, even if you are away, even if you are, we are here like this together with you. Yeah, things will just be fine. No worries. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Wow. Well, so this is it, and I can see. Oh, they are clean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we haven't done uh, painting yet. Yeah. Because when you do painting, it will tamper just a bit with the windows. Mm -hmm. But I'll choose a person who is very careful with painting because we don't want him to interfere so much with the glass glass because yeah. they'll have to repeat also the paint here yeah these sides which look gray with the putty or putty putty oh yeah. i i actually noticed uh some they tell me to call it mm -hmm. putty like for pu then t for t for drinking mm -hmm. but some call it potty oh like potty. p o then potty like potty like you, you understand potty potty okay for potty for potty i know the the one for kids yeah where you train your kid first mm -hmm. to to help themselves yeah they you know the round thing that almost look like a hot pot yes. <laughs> it's not really a hot pot just a small one yeah it has its own lid mm -hmm. that is for potty yeah. potty yeah? yeah but for Though they they have written on that can putty p u t t y mm -hmm. so 
I don't know. Now they told me, sure. now, now the pronunciation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's some putty. they told me, they told me it's putty and some told me putty. Now I'm confused which is which. <laughs> Maybe putty. Putty. Yeah, putty. Yeah, even me I'm seeing putty. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. It's a nice name. Yeah, it's a good name. Yeah. So this putty mm -hmm. is the one used for sticking the window glasses so mm -hmm. that they can be more firm. They put silicone, yes. But this one is put so that they can be much more firm. Yeah. So, um, he told me when he'll come back to paint, mm -hmm. he'll have to paint these sides for the putty so uh -huh. that the whole window is black. I needed oh. a black color. For he'll me, it's black. Here. here. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Here it'll have to be black. Oh. So they become black together with the metal. Yeah. For oh. sure. Yeah. Such so that when someone comes, he thinks this one is a metal. When it's black. Yeah. yeah. Actually, that's the way it, it usually um, be put. Mm -hmm. So right now it has dried. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Until we open from inside. From inside. Yeah. Okay. No problem. Yeah. So, wow. I'm glad uh, baby Carol cleaned here. Thank you so much. It's okay. Thank you for no, always being there. Worry. Yeah, guys, you know baby Carol is you that. Know, yeah. Just like me. Yeah. Yeah, just like me. Yeah. Yeah. When you're not there, you don't you don't have to worry. Mm -hmm. Everything will be fine. Yeah, for real. So actually, guys, baby Karu is that kind of sister whom you would want to have around. Maybe you know, she's so helpful, mm -hmm. so much ever Thank since you. we started this project. Thank you. She has been uh, helpful also. Thank so uh, thank you so much. I'm grateful. Mm -hmm. And also for my beloved subscribers, mm -hmm. thank you so much for always showing me love. I get this new energy always because of you guys. I don't know without you guys where I would have been. I really don't know. But for because of you guys, we are here standing today. We are here doing some uh, progress. We are here doing some one, two, three, and uh, you know, making life meaningful. So, thank you so much. I'm so grateful of all of you. Yeah. I may not mention all names mm -hmm. until I finished, but I know you guys are so loving. Thank yeah. you so much for always, uh, you know, motivating us and yeah. you know, just having us. I'll always repeat this word. So, thank you so much. I'm yeah. just grateful wherever you are, wherever you're watching from. Yeah very very grateful yeah. thank you so much and i love you yeah big big love big love yeah 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 so from here we go inside inside, inside. okay okay oh guys this is the door already i'm imagining <laughs> we've already completed the house yeah so the big arrow cleaned here it's sparkling clean yeah it's shining actually yeah so thank you, you so you much can see the this one here, yeah. there's some reflection from the other side of this this gutter. Oh yeah, by the way, it's really shining. It's there now. Yeah, <laughs> it's shining like it's so clear from the outside part. Yeah. So, I don't know but which color we'll put later. But For the? For the house outside. Mm -hmm. But it's going to look nice, guys. So keep on uh, bringing on the yes, nice colors and suggestion and mm -hmm. ideas. I appreciate. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Now this one is for the outside part of the house, mm -hmm. especially for those viewers watching this for the first, very, very first time. Yeah. Guys, uh, maybe I can explain briefly. We are doing a project on this house. Yeah. And... Um, here it's called African Serenity Garden. We are trying mm -hmm. to change this place into a beautiful, nice home and garden mm -hmm. and African one, yeah, African yeah. way. Because most of the things we try to blend in with the African uh, African themes. Because mm -hmm. later we'll even put an African uh, thing that, like, it, it looks like a hat, not really a hat, but a gazebo, yeah. You know, something that has grass on top and yeah. some mud sideways. Mm -hmm. Just traditional, you know. Yeah. Because this one is Africa. Yeah. African. We don't forget Africa. And also, I, for I forgot to tell you, your head looks good. Thank your you. Hair. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Before I was... It's painful? Uh, for now, not so, not so much. Just mm -hmm. a bit of it. Mm -hmm. I was used to having, you know, 
the other hair it had stayed on my head for so long i remember for so long <laughs> when i heard i'm going to the big city mm -hmm. i said hey let me make some change right now at least you know i had some time to do all that mm -hmm. so i put this thank you so much and i can say it doesn't look bad it looks lovely mm -hmm. yeah and i haven't done for long thank you yeah thank you so much thank you yeah yeah i haven't done the styling yet mm -hmm. but maybe yeah, i'll do it i can style you mm -hmm. yeah i know how to style really yeah wow you'll make it for me okay okay well, you are free tell me okay mm -hmm. anytime yeah because i know maybe yeah, can right now, even if you want <laughs> i can i can do it you'll do it yeah okay we'll it's not it. painful right now yeah it's not okay. painful yeah i can do it thank you mm -hmm. so after this a uh, baby car is going to fix my hair mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah guys so this is the front side i can also see uh, she has done nice uh, actually i uh, did this uh we had uh this this is our beautiful neighbor mm -hmm. uh, who came and helped me and we cleaned with him together with with we cleaned together mm -hmm. uh like he helped me so we did uh, the two of us wow thank you yeah. so much you did Welcome great job mm -hmm. thank yeah. you thank you so much and also tell tell mm -hmm. him i really appreciate I, I will tell him today yeah yeah so for me i, I thanked him because he helped me a lot yeah and Don't maybe in case it. of anything maybe we'll, if we'll have some uh, work around to do we can also call him yeah yeah no problem yeah yeah so we use this, this one as our ladder <laughs> oh this <laughs> yeah what is it called and it's strong it's very strong actually yeah. this one the masons made it mm -hmm. so that they can work on heights yeah. places which are high mm -hmm. so yeah yeah it's uh, helpful so that's why it's good when you are done doing a certain kind of job don't um don't damage these things mm -hmm. we just keep them yeah. they'll get some news later yeah. Yeah, because we couldn't reach here. If it couldn't be here, mm -hmm. I don't know what we could use. Because if we could use a ladder, it will, you know, it it usually must have a place to stand like this. So it mm -hmm. could definitely stand on the glasses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but this one helped a lot. Thank you. And there's plenty of water inside the tank. Wow, it's full. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. It's so, full. so the past two days, the rain fell. Yeah, no, actually, mm -hmm. uh, recently, uh. It hasn't been raining a lot, so I think uh, the water which maybe had been raining for the past is one which uh, it collected itself until it's full, like full on the, they say brim. To the brim. Yeah, it's full. And we've never actually used the water here for a long time. Yeah. So, wow, that would be nice. It would really help around working around, yeah. you know. Yeah. Uh, especially when we will come to fixing the other things mm -hmm. we'll have to use lots of water but mm -hmm. the part where we needed that water guys oh my god it plastering wasn't there. it wasn't there yeah we when were... we need it is when it's not there but when you don't need it that much it's when it comes in plenty yeah yeah i think it's like that's how sometimes life is you know mm -hmm. when you need something so much mm -hmm. you never see it mm -hmm. but when you are done with it mm -hmm that's when it comes in plenty not yeah. even halfway yeah because uh actually guys we had changed the gutters mm -hmm. so the first type of gutter was not collecting water so that's why we really suffered so much especially when we were doing the plastering we had to buy water every time yeah. and it was during the dry season mm -hmm. the wells were very dry mm -hmm. these are well on the other side and also ours completely dry yeah dry. it was only mud and the mud was not even wet it was dry dry completely like yeah. it was so dry during that season yeah so we had we were forced to be buying water from uh, you know the center where they bring uh with those vehicles called tuk tuk mm -hmm. the small ones which carry so many jerry cans around 20 yeah for one trip yeah so we used to put that even uh three times in a day in a day guys yeah. imagine so i used to move around come back move around come back yeah. to ensure the water is there so right now i'm, I'm hearing it so much and i'm happy I'm, i think it's because also for the gutters yeah yeah because the gutter they are also good because i remember the the last gutter with the the first one which mm -hmm. they put mm -hmm. it was raining like heavy, heavy day. but and that nothing. time the masons were there yeah so you know you are knowing ah today they won't be that cost for the water we know the tank is full mm -hmm. but when we come here 
the tank is empty. empty. Get the water is on the bottom. Like, Completely, so like there is nothing. Yeah. It's as if it hasn't rained. Yeah. Because the gutter was only running from this side up to that corner. Yeah. Not even finishing the other corner, just a bit of it. Yeah. So it had only one side to collect water. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, this type of iron sheets really collects lots of water. Yeah. Yeah, they are known for also nice collection of water. And right now, you know, it's so clean because it's still new. Mm -hmm. Because I remember, uh, you see, like the the gutter, the iron sheet which is the, is is in the other house, in the first house. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sometimes the you get the iron sheet. Uh, they usually get rust, but even if they rust, they still collect clean water. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. But right now, it's collecting clean water. It's so new. Yeah. Wow, I'm happy right now. Mm -hmm. And also, uh, we extended also the gutters mm -hmm. from that point, the other point, mm -hmm. this side. Let me show you. From that corner, mm -hmm. you know, it runs round, round the house, round the house until the other point where the tank is. Where the tank is. So there is yeah. more water. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right guys. Now when you open here, it's clean water. Yeah, let's see. Clean. And it's, be, it's coming with pressure. Yeah. The other time it was so, so little. And it's coming slowly. It slowly. Yeah. Yeah. So this means the water is high. When the water is so much, mm -hmm. there is high pressure. Yeah. Yeah. So, wow, I'm really happy for this. Mm -hmm. And uh, the tank. Oh my god, it's not even moving. You can hear. <laughs> Full to the brim. Yeah. That means when the, when the water collects itself, mm -hmm. it even pours outside during now rainy season because the water it's is small. so much. Even you wish you could have again another thing to put the water in. Yeah. You know that pinch when you feel the water is pouring down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know the plumber had told me mm -hmm. you, this is uh, a 2,500 liter tank. Mm -hmm. So when he was fixing the, the gutters, he had told me I mm -hmm. go and try very hard and buy a bigger tank like mm -hmm. 3000 mm -hmm. or um, a more bigger one mm -hmm. but he try he told me to try to buy a 3000 one mm -hmm. then maybe this one mm -hmm. when they'll put uh, the tower or something like a stand for it uh, mm -hmm. to be on top mm -hmm. they can fix it mm -hmm. and then it will have also pressure to collect to water pump. from yeah to pump water yeah inside the house wow. so since i hadn't really prepared myself well mm -hmm. and i didn't have enough money so yeah we couldn't now buy another bigger one because he told me this one is going is a small tank is going to be overwhelmed with them oh it now needs a bigger one than this one yeah so that it mm -hmm. collects enough water and it doesn't overflow oh. yeah so that's what really happened mm -hmm. so i just told myself maybe later when i'll reorganize myself because you know building is a process anyway yeah. it's a step-by-step -step thing mm -hmm. i told myself i won't really pressure myself i'll just yeah. uh, wait a bit and then with time i'm going to organize myself again and buy another bigger tank so yeah. that you know it can collect enough water because yeah. he this place when it's dry it's really a problem getting yeah. water because on the other side of the tap, tap hey yeah usually find lots of long uh, line a uh, one person can come even with five jerry can mm -hmm. so you get a line like with more people so you get there's too much jerry can so yeah. and they don't open it like all the time all the they time. just open it for some time again they close it so yeah. when they close it you find lots of people they go back home without water mm -hmm. it pushes you again to wait until next time mm -hmm. so again next time when again uh, you don't reach there earlier again you, you won't find water mm -hmm. yeah so it needs you at least uh, when you have water like this mm -hmm. at least they they'll be it will make like much work easier mm -hmm. yeah yeah wow so that is that is true actually guys yeah. so that's why i the good thing the base of the tank is mm -hmm. bigger mm -hmm. so yeah i can with the time i'll just organize and uh, buy a bigger tank because yeah. this is small this one the main reason we had bought it and actually guys it was a nice nice surprise for michael bland yeah I've never forgotten that this was uh when we were doing the building and construction mm -hmm. when we were at the 
foundation level. Mm -hmm. So we really had a problem of where we could get water. We borrowed so many uh, small tanks from our neighbors, yeah. but they couldn't help because uh, at the end of the day, the neighbor needs uh, his or her ta uh, tank. Yeah. Not really a, a tank. A super drum. A the super drum. One. Yeah, super yeah. drum. So at the end of the day, they need it. So yeah. uh, turning it back, coming back, returning it back, and sometimes the masons could, you know, get late with them. So it was difficult yeah. during that time. So this was a very big surprise. It mm. has helped us all yeah, through yeah. the construction up to now is okay. still very, very helpful. So mm. it was like a permanent thing. Yeah, because imagine right now if we couldn't have it, right now we could be now at that point also waiting for the water to fetch. Yeah, very yeah. true. So I'm really happy mm. and very, very grateful of this. Yeah. So this has really pushed us mm -hmm. and um, I don't know, work could have been slower if you couldn't have this tank. Yeah. So because of this tank, uh, it has enabled uh, storage of water to be much easier. Yeah. And I'm really happy. And also later we installed a, a tap there. A tap, so yeah. we won't be bending so much uh, mm -hmm. when you want water. Maybe yeah. once in a while, but yeah. not really so much because we have a well. Mm -hmm. But the well is just a seasonal well. Actually, before that, yeah. I wanted again you to see a big surprise here. Ooh, oh my god <laughs> yeah some nice big oh, surprise oh, oh, oh. Yeah. be careful okay yeah. let me pass through here oh, but uh we have uh one bad news mm -hmm. and we have this big news here mm -hmm. yeah so you remember the surprise the mexican marigold actually they have really grown so big wow so huge and wow see the height again yeah so long and they were like there's also this types. mixture mm -hmm. i don't know which kind of uh, plant is this mm -hmm. but there was three species yeah but i'm seeing one species mm -hmm. is the one which has grown this one here the mexican marigold oh yeah so, so we, mm -hmm. uh, we had put this in a nursery bed mm -hmm. and we have to transfer them because mm -hmm. right now they have grown i left when they haven't popped this way very well mm -hmm. so right now they have grown they need to be transplanted yeah. into uh, several places in the compound yeah these mexican marigold uh, it has a, some kind of scent which mm -hmm. chases away uh, things like snakes yeah. mosquitoes yeah. so it's a very helpful plant and it actually uh, has yellow flowers yeah so yeah and also it's beauty to the compound yeah. so we'll be transplanting them in uh, uh, several places because there are many actually yeah. there are more than 10 yeah there are more than 10 and guys it's first time you are planting the mexican actually there's someone who told me like they don't stay for so long yeah yeah like it reaches a point uh they they just like wither they die yeah when there's they have much he told me like uh, around six months like this they they die mm -hmm. yeah so so they don't really have a long lifespan yeah yeah so the good thing the way we'll plant others mm -hmm. i think also others will grow Oh, like at least, uh, oh, uh, the good thing I was told, yeah. when it grows, it drops the seed. Yeah, so yeah. that's the beauty. So that's the beauty. Even if they dry up, you have the seeds with you, so mm -hmm. you can still uh, replant them. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So I think the Mexican is the one which has really grown, grown in where? plenty. Yeah, so there's this type. Oh, there's another one here. There's a borage plant. Yeah, this one and this one. So this one, they haven't grown so many of them, mm -hmm. but we'll replant again later mm -hmm. and see and also oh, uh, i think even this one you see there are kind of two types are you sure this is not a black jack <laughs> no <laughs> no it's no. not a black jack you, you, there's another type here there were see? three yeah wow. there were three yeah three types the borage plant yeah. mexican marigold mm -hmm. and uh, there was a name porridge for b-o-r-a-g-e oh yeah i was hearing porridge not, not porridge <laughs> for drinking <laughs> <laughs> actually there's this one yeah, yeah. so this they are type. the three yeah yeah so this one has grown and this one mm -hmm. yeah and this one you know almost look like black jack yeah so you can confuse it with the weed yeah yeah but you're going to look for a very nice place for it we transplant we it. transplant them around the compound because uh, this compound guys we sometimes get new visitors like snakes yeah from the forest on that side mm -hmm. so they find a place where if, when they get the place is bushy they tend to move in yeah. but at least right now the way i'm back we can clear out the land yeah make it well plant them because mm -hmm. that one will do it in one day 
So there is aloe vera here, very strong. Mm -hmm. Maybe I can pluck a piece of it for the first time. Harvesting aloe vera for the first time. Medicine. You want to try it on your face? No, not direct because it will be harsh. <laughs> and actually this one when a chicken is usually sick, mm -hmm. uh, most people rearing chicken, they usually give it the aloe vera. And it's, it's so medicine. bitter. Yeah. yeah, this is medicine. Yeah from very many things yeah. you find uh, most uh, medicines mm -hmm. they usually have it and also herbal medicines they usually include aloe vera in yeah. it yeah yeah so this is a very useful herb plant mm -hmm. yeah this one we had bought it and uh, we planted it also yeah. and uh, yeah i think it's time uh, we start changing things yeah we start and for that one, I don't like maybe the soil was bad. Yeah, it withered. Yeah, the black is just food. Oh my god, it's not even. Oh, yeah, I'm seeing. I think maybe it's uh, maybe the, soil. the soil. Yeah. Maybe hey guys. it didn't withstand the type of soil mm -hmm. over here. Yeah. yeah. Though I've not really seen many people planting jackfruits yeah. around. I've so. never seen even one. Maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what is this biting me? Ants. Yeah. <laughs> no, black you know jack. Ants, they are really plenty. Yeah. And they usually, when you stand in a one place, they mm -hmm. don't bite you that time. They first enter inside the clothes. So they, they have entered. They bite you from the inside. Yeah, now they bite you from it. force you to remove the clothes <laughs> so Very that true. you can find it. Yeah. Yeah. We still have another big surprise. Which Maybe one? can pass through here. Wow, so guys, I'm um, just being updated with <laughs> the few days. Yeah. Oh my god, see, the hibiscus has really woken up. Yeah, it has grown, <laughs> even it has changed the shape. Wow, it was dry, guys, very mm -hmm. dry. So, right now, it looks very lovely. And the leaves they went and grew so huge. Wow, they changed, meaning, uh, there were two, right? No, one. Oh, there were one, one hibiscus. Wow, yeah. it's so beautiful. Thank you. So I think I'm going to look for also a nice fertilizer mm -hmm. and uh, put for them. Because right now it's time for rain. So when I put fertilizer, they are going to grow well. Well, yeah. Yeah. So this is the it. The gold star crotum is still... It hasn't changed <laughs> much. Yeah. Yeah. It's still struggling. <laughs> yeah, but it needs manure. Oh, so that they'll grow big. Yeah. yeah. You can see the snake plant, it has grown also huge. Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah. it's only the gold star which is which struggling. Yeah. And also I had the snake plant, you can also remove the, uh, how can I say, call this, the small shoots mm -hmm. from the sides oh, yeah, and replant them. It. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, those are good plants which we brought. Mm -hmm. Just That was just a small... Uh, amount of it yeah. yeah later we are going to bring something and wow. see how big they are <laughs> this one also has bloomed yeah. these are pumpkin leaves guys yeah yeah we use this we use this uh, as vegetable i've not yet seen yet but there is a time we harvested one pumpkin from here yeah and it was so huge there yeah. were many it's kind of the other ones they withered mm -hmm. they were like three they were that because of very very little rain for during that time and yeah. so much sun and also construction on the other side mm -hmm. and wow my vegetables See? are smiling <laughs> wow <laughs> wow this is so beautiful yeah. wow the vegetables have really done well we are going even to pluck some of them yeah i'm really happy of this and grateful yeah so wow this is the beauty of it we had removed two rows there mm -hmm. were four rows yeah. so two rows when they were doing digging up on this side mm -hmm. so it's remaining two but when we'll start landscaping i don't know if we'll remove even all of it yeah. but we'll see on how we'll do because we have to shape our compound yeah when you shape our compound it's easier to locate where you can put your your plants yeah yeah at least you can know here put some kales right right now you can just remove know again later this is kales uh, this is a location where we, we can plant kales yeah like that yeah yeah see the sugar cane wow see the lemon today we are <laughs> compound house to <laughs> Wow, lemon grass. This is the beauty of rainfall, guys. Yeah. When rainfall comes, it comes with all blessings to the farmers. Yeah. Yeah. They have grown so big. Wow. 
and at least right now again we can again transplant it mm -hmm. we can take again another another portion mm -hmm. you know the, those ones only one grew the other ones withered oh the one which i transplanted the other day yeah yeah so it worked yeah it worked only mm -hmm. one but yeah. the two dried mm -hmm. i'll show you there on the downer side where we've we've left there okay yeah but see how big they have grown they have grown nice and i'm happy wow so guys that's the lemongrass yeah. and then popo the popo trees dried <laughs> i don't know why you see the they're drying from the sideways yeah yeah uh, it's, it should be like that so they the dry more, they fall then they they produce new ones new ones up there oh yeah so yeah, wow is so big. this one is big and yeah. it, it hasn't really changed the color why you're waiting for it yeah. the birds will confirm for us <laughs> <laughs> but it's not yet yeah it's not yet mm. you know when it starts i was telling my people the moment it starts turning orange mm -hmm. the bird confirm it first you will get they have already chewed they True. don't wait they don't wait yeah and you know what mm -hmm. i'm seeing another surprise Banana! <laughs> yeah. This banana wants to put some bananas uh, inside for it. the first time. Yeah. Yeah. So if you want to produce this banana for the first time, this is how the shoot starts, guys. Yeah, then they'll start now putting from the inside. Yeah, wow. And it, it kind of it will be so big. Yeah, so I think we'll have to put later a support system for it mm -hmm. so that it doesn't fall because yeah. the banana can be so big for it. Yeah. And it will be the first time we'll be harvesting banana, banana and this type is for ripening, mm -hmm. for cooking they are two. Mm -hmm. There is that one on that side, the smaller one. one there. They are there. Mm -hmm. That one hasn't really done well, but this one I think it's it's coming up. Yeah. Wow. So I think, up soil. yeah, here it is, guys. Yeah. So this one is the green banana. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Remember the nini? Mm -hmm. This one? Ah, the passion. Wow, the passion <laughs> also has struggled. Yeah. Wow. And it, it has grown. Don't have so deeply, but it has right. tried to catch up. Yeah. Wow, and I'm also happy. some nice spells. Can you see? Yeah. It will bring some, some privacy. Something beautiful. <laughs> I think this rain usually changes things just naturally. Yeah, like, when it rains, everything grows. Mm -hmm, you don't strain like when it's during the dry season. Mm -hmm. So I can see, wow, the fence has brought some nice flowers around. This fence usually has thorns. Yeah. So this one, when you pass through, you are pricked. I don't know the name of this uh, kind of plant. Mm -hmm. Maybe guys, you can tell us the name. Yeah. Also, if it grows around your areas, but this one we are we use it to fence our compound, and also it's beauty. Yeah. Yeah, guys. So we live near the road, and the road, they try to make it uh, expanded. It. Yeah, expand it. Mm -hmm. So it's 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 expanded. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can see even the guavas. There's some good job the rain did. Yeah, the rain did nice job. Yeah. <laughs> so the guavas they are also trying to come up so well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, guys, that was the update for now, guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this nice house tour. Mm -hmm. I also enjoyed. Thank you so much for always watching our videos. I really do appreciate. Mm -hmm. So the next phase will be doing the wiring. I, when I went to Nairobi, I went to bring the... Um, to also check out on the materials for wiring. So they had put for me uh, today. So probably tomorrow, because it works on 24 hours, mm -hmm. they are going. To, we are going to bring them tomorrow. Oh, yeah, wow. yeah. I, I got a message to notify me. They are, they will if they, they will arrive by 24 hours, mm -hmm. and when they will arrive, they'll notify me. Oh. It depends on the company mm -hmm. that you send through. Yeah. So uh, as they are going to to bring them, you are going to focus now on the wiring part of the house which oh. we've been so soon really waiting be for yeah wow we can't move to ceiling mm -hmm. if we haven't done wiring from the inside it yeah, will, sure. you have to follow every step mm -hmm. every procedure because if you seal fast it will need you to 
make some holes mm -hmm. when doing the wiring. Yeah, and you know, damaging the house. Yeah. And our brother, mm -hmm. the Duchess, is going to help out. Wow. Yeah, so I'm really grateful. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. And uh, yeah, we're going to begin the work tomorrow. I had some good time in Nairobi. I really mm -hmm. enjoyed. And also, thank you so much for praying uh, for BT. BT arrived safely and uh, he'll be exploring on the other side mm -hmm. as we explore also on this side yeah yeah so thanks so much guys for your prayers best yana keni <laughs> yana keni guys <laughs> my, my tongue we slipped swallowing the words. i'm so sorry <laughs> it's your girl yana keni mm -hmm. and my sister baby caro over here yeah so guys big love i hope you enjoy this vlog mm -hmm. and uh yeah it, it was just uh, to update you of what has happened mm -hmm. the things which we missed around mm -hmm. so we're gonna start from there mm -hmm. thank you so much I, if, I i appreciate i love you so so much if you haven't subscribed kindly do so put some like kindly do so yeah. big love and big bye love. bye see you soon till tomorrow yeah guys bye